this academic game plan is kind of like the football team's version of study hall. It gives all the coaches a chance to check in with their players, make sure they're doing everything on track as far as you know classes are concerned. If they got any grades coming back, any paper assignments due, anything academically related to their schedules, this, this is an opportunity for them to, to check in with the coaches and, and just make sure they're on the same page. About 15 minutes before I got to go work out, I'm ready to go work out with the rest of the team. We got running and we got lifting. That should take about anywhere between two to two and a half hours, give or take, depending on, you know, how we got to do today. The seniors, myself included, will be running, we'll be doing the run by ourselves. So we'll uh, get the cones lined up, tell everybody else what exactly the run is. Just finished a little additional workout. Didn't do as bad as I did on Tuesday. It's 10 o'clock and I'm here at Business 455. It's marketing strategy. Uh, it's pretty much a group oriented class. I'm gonna get ready to meet with my group for a little bit and we're gonna go over some things with our professor who, who doubles as a CEO. They try to make it as realistic as possible and, and bring some, some real life perspective into the class. It's actually a marketing simulation where our team is competing with a host of other teams to see who can sell the most computer products. It's a little bit after 12, I just got out of Business 455, a marketing strategy. Uh, I just got down to the coach's office and I'm getting ready to watch a little bit of game film to study up on my skills. I try to pick out some slots in my day that I have free that are convenient for me to come down here and you know, talk to the coaches, see if they have anything that they want to express to me, any new plays, new schemes, anything for my benefit, just to learn a little bit and study the opponents that we got coming up this year. We play San Diego State the first game. I watched them a little bit a couple times and also just for my general knowledge start to recognizing recognizing coverages receivers. So that's something that's gonna be important for me. After one o'clock I have a meeting with Chris Baker. He is the Associate Athletic Director, we're going to speak about my participation in Mustang Madness, which is a charity event to you know try to increase sponsors and, and donors for the university and the athletic department. They would like me to just speak to the audience on exactly how important you know scholarships are to the people that they, they benefit. Two fifteen, it just depends on the workout for the day. I don't think today's a long one. We're doing the Tuesday workout. There's not too much to this. He's got he's got sheets written up for every position, mainly the skill guys and the and alignment. So everybody will come in here and grab the sheet. Go from there, start with a little warm up, and then get right into it. That's some of the most exciting uh, moments of the day. Come that that Saturday afternoon, everybody's there supporting, yelling, yelling their heads off. We run out the little tunnel. And, and you got a whole lot of pent up energy ready to, to take the field. That's some of the best one in the world. If I give some advice to anybody who, who gets a chance to come watch the game, is, is just yell your head off every chance you get, except when the offense has the ball. <laughs> the football takes up a, a big portion of your schedule. What you'll find is a lot of players, when they're not in class or they're uh, not on campus here, they're looking for an opportunity to take naps, sit down, kick their feet up because it's, it's such a demanding lifestyle physically. And, and, and mentally and even emotionally just because it, it drains you so much. I really want to commend, you know, our team and athletes, you know, throughout the campus who, who put in so much, so much work to, to try to be the best at their craft. I think that we love to compete. We have a knack for taking every chance we get to measure our skill set against somebody else's. I have to say that that's what drives me to, to do this every day. And, and, you know, it's fun when you do something that you enjoy daily. It's hard to complain about it.